Hi, welcome to the Center at Home. This is Vicki. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Um, today I'm going to talk about the Pier 1, um, the rune sprays that I like the most from them. And um, so, you know, let's get started. The number one that I like is Asian Spice. Uh, this is my favorite. Like I said, this is my signature scent for my house. This one's very strong. This one lingers. And this one, I'm not even joking, this one will last forever in a room. Um, you can spray it and leave and come back and it'll still smell. So, what I like to do is whenever I leave before I go to work, I like to spray it. And, um, I mean, it won't be there when I get back or anything like that, but it doesn't last that long. But it's super good. Um, or like if I go to the store or something like that, if I have company coming over or something and with puppies and dogs, stuff like that, this is like the one that I love to, sp to spray because it's like definitely eliminates any odors completely, immediately. So this one is Asian Spice, and this one is like an um, oriental floral, I guess. It's very spicy, and I, like I said before, this reminds me of totally, I mean, smells exactly like Pier 1 when you go in there in the store. The next one is Sugar Cinnamon. This one I talked about just recently, and this one smells just like a warm vanilla sugar from Bath & Body Works, so it's kind of like a warm vanilla sugar, like a um, perfume. That one's really good. That one also is a very good, good performer. And this one, Tuscan Spice, and this one smells really good, but it kind of smells like a perfume. Um, it's kind of like, it's not like Asian Spice. It's kind of like a tobacco-y or something like that. Like, no, it's not. It's like a perfume. This one smells like a vanilla perfume, like kind of like this one. But a little different, just a little, di little difference. But I don't know exactly what the difference is. But this one smells really, really good. This one is like one of my favorites. They don't sell it anymore. And this one, oh my god, this one smells so good. This one smells like um, violets, I would think. Like a, like a very soft violets in the field. I don't know, but it just smells so good. This is sweet and a set. They don't have this anymore, but. I may have to look for it like on Amazon, hopefully they'll have it, but this one smells, oh my god, this smells so good. I have four re-diffusers of this scent, they were on clearance last summer, and I don't even want to use them because I can't find it anywhere, they don't sell it anymore. Sweet Anisette, I just love that, I mean it smells very romantic, very soft, like, I don't know, it just reminds me of flowers in the field, very soft. Um, lilacs, I don't know, but it's just such a beautiful scent. Oh my gosh, it's just so gorgeous. And here's pineapple basil. This is the one that I had the oil. This one smells just like pineapple, very summery. And I did have sea air. I don't have it here with me, but I do have also sea air. These two, um, ba um, pineapple basil and sea air, the ones I use during the summer. And all the, well, I use them all throughout, but these are the ones that are more that I use during the summer. And then like these, um, I'll use during the winter or to be honest I use them all year round but these are the ones that I have readily available for like the bathroom or or my room or something like that is this and the sea air they're available you know readily available but these uh, I, I actually have like two or three of these you know back stock or just stockpile these and that one is you know I don't use that right now but yeah, so that's that, and but like like I said, the Sweet Anna set, oh my god, I need to find it again because I just love that one. So between the two, these are going to be my favorite, the Sweet Anna set and the Asian Spice. And then these two are very similar, the Sugared Cinnamon. And these are very similar, but there's a little little difference, but these are very good. And they, they are, all these sprays here are very good performers. They have very good scent throw, and they really do fill the room. And like they're really good, like I said, if you want to mask a scent immediately, quickly, uh, they're perfect. So I really love Pure One um, room sprays. I've been using them for many, many years. And um, I don't like their candles because they don't have a throw. So I never buy the candles or their tea lights, anything like that. The only rediffuser that I buy is Asian Spice. That's the only one that actually fills the room and actually does make the room smell. So, but the others... Like, there's a patchouli. That one smells pretty good. Um, there's also, oh, God, I forgot what it's called. Um, the patchouli one is good. The Asian Spice is good. Like, the Sea Air or any others, I don't get it in the reed diffusers because they don't have much throw at all. Um, but there was another one. I think it was this one, the Sugar Cinnamon. 
that one smelled really good. It actually had, you know, it did fill the room and it did, did linger or did, did, you know, fill the room up with the scent. And all you do is switch the sticks, you know, turn them upside down or whatever, like switch them out or whatever. But it's really, really good. Uh, there were diffusers, those, those two or three at least. But anyways, that's going to be the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. You have a great day. And if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And thank you so much. Bye.